damn it. Where's all my stuff? Come, we have no time. Why did you take the book from me? The content of this book and the ritual you collected is of great importance to the Order. I could have given it to you after I finished. Some things cannot wait. Sure. Okay, I'm almost there. What's next? We have to figure out why we're stuck. I assume you are too. Yeah, I think I might have lost the connection to my companion. Hmm. It looked like he collided with the edge of the limbo. I bet he could show us how to get out of here. Oh, then I think we need to wake him up. Mr. Companion, we need you right now. Our friend Benedict really needs you right now. What? What happened? The explosion. Wait. Benedict? Thomas. Thomas! What the hell did you do? Benedict. Are you all right? No, I'm not. You tried to... You killed me! No, I assure you I had nothing to do with the explosion. Yes, but we talked already. We met and... and you attacked me. What? Why would I do that? Uh, I d don't know. To wake up my companion, I guess? To break out of this loop? Loop? Interesting. Do you see the... Chapel to the east, at the top? Yeah. You want to kill me again? I'll be there. But this time I'll be ready. I understand.
could really use your help. I'm really sorry about before. I'll fix it. I'll get you back. Maybe we don't have to... No. Let's do this. Damn. I need my gun. Benedict? Benedict, are you alright? Why does the Order need the ritual? Benedict, I'm glad you're all right. We can talk. The chapel to the... the east at the top. Sure. Now answer the question. Let's talk face I'm to... I'm not moving until you answer the question. The order doesn't exactly need the ritual. What? At least, not as much as I do. Elaborate. I need to open a portal. Why? You can project yourself to Limbo anytime you want. It's not a portal to the Limbo. No. No way. Sure, there might be more dimensions out there, but no one has found a way to access them, and so many have tried. I think I've stumbled upon the answer. Your father's work proved to be invaluable. That sounds a bit too crazy, even for me. And I have a demon in my head. Well then, Maybe just like me, you are a man of little faith. Come to the chapel, Benedict. We still need to get out. Right. I'm afraid I might have told you too much. I cannot let you go now. I thought as much. Benedict? Benedict, are you all right? What does it lead to? What? How did you? We're stuck in a loop. We talk, we fight, we talk, we fight. Last time you told me about the portal. Then you killed me again. Is this some kind of trick? 
No tricks. Just honest conversation. You said you're a man of little faith. Enough! Don't you dare talk to me like that! I guess that's not the angle.
Benedict? Benedict, are you all right? That portal you want to open. What? How did you? We're stuck in a loop. We talk, we fight, we talk, we fight. Last time you told me about the portal. Then you killed me. <laughs> Is this some kind of trick? No tricks. Just honest conversation. Listen. I see that you're on a mission, and a personal one at that. Believe me, if there's anyone that could understand you, it's me. I know about the portal. I get it. It's important to you. What you don't get is that our goals don't conflict. I don't care where it leads you. Continue. Let me translate the ritual first. Once I have my answers, I'll go. Leave the translated ritual in the house for you to use. I'll think about it. We can talk about it in the chapel to the east at the top. lost without your voice inside my head. Sort of empty. This misfortune was not one that I savored either. I had grown accustomed to my prison. To you.
at last. I'm glad you're back. I missed you, whether you like it or not. Feel free to browse my wares. I've got what I needed. Till next time. He's gone. I can see you have paid a heavy price for it. Give me a moment, and I'll translate it for you. Benedict, I've experienced something odd. I just woke up from the longest journey to the limbo I've ever made. It feels like a distant dream now, and yet the memories are still so vivid in my mind. I wonder if it was all just a figment of my imagination, a trick of the mind. But then I see the scars on my hands, and I feel that it was real, and that you shared this experience with me. Do you remember the portal that we spoke of? The one that led to the realm beyond? I know that all of this must sound like the ravings of a madman, but I implore you, Benedict, do not dismiss it out of hand. We have seen things that others would call impossible, and I truly believe that there is more to this world than we can ever hope to understand. I know not what lies beyond that portal, but I am willing to risk everything to find out. And since we found the limbo, we found the first circle of hell, then I know it sounds crazy, but I cannot shake the feeling that it might lead to something truly wondrous. Perhaps even... Heaven? You want to open a portal to heaven? Indeed. I feel we are close. Closer than ever. Keep the book for now. Use it. Continue on your path, and I have a feeling we will meet again. In the meantime, I have one last piece of the puzzle to take care of. Farewell. The news I have for you is grim. This ritual is old, chaotic, evil. It's what made us, us. Then, 
It surprises me that you two are even alive. What's worse, I don't see a way to undo it. But this would mean that we will perish, no matter what. I'm so sorry, my dear. All that effort? All of it was for nothing then? No, not for nothing. I... I know this is not what you want to hear right now, but there is still something worth fighting for. As you know, demons interest me, and I sense there is still one worth saving. A young one. A pure one. It was brought here, born out of one of the most terrible of emotions. False hope. It's here somewhere. I can see it taking shelter in the house. Fearing for its life. Yes. I felt something. But its true nature eluded my comprehension. Wait. That's why you stayed. Were you even in need of saving? Yes. And no. Fate has brought you to me. Bullshit. First Thomas used me, and now you're trying to use me too. Yes, I need you. I observed this Inquisitor, Thomas, when he was here. I think he wants to be the first to make contact with the pure being. Why? I don't know. But he is not to be trusted. No, he is not. Then, I need you even more, please, my dear. I know your life is slipping through your fingers, but you cannot do anything to remedy it. There is, however, a life you can save. It spawned from your father's feelings. In a twisted way, it could be considered kin. I don't know. What could we do? Whenever I try to concentrate on it, I am drowned in the remnants of feelings in this house and the deaths of its inhabitants. It might be wise to retrace their steps, to find their ends. I have no future, whether with you by my side or not. We are doomed. We may be doomed, but we are doomed together, Benedict. Yeah, let's go. One last case. <laughs>